Hello guys, welcome back to Chill Stick Reviews. Uh, so today I'll be doing a solo video since my friend did not agree to smoke menthols since he doesn't really like it. So therefore I will say I'm a more versatile smoker since I will smoke like whatever cigarette depending on the occasion as well as my feeling. So today I was feeling uh, LD Purple Zooms. Okay, so LD actually stands for Legat to Cat, which is a Russian, Russian brand. Started up in 1999, which made a big hit. And yeah, I was used to compete with brands such as LM and Paul Mall. However, in 2007, it was sold over to Japan Tobacco International. And I think it's currently based in USA or Japan, if I'm not wrong. Alright, without further ado, let's open it up. Okay, so looking at the pack design, you can see that it's actually black and blue with the white LD print as well as the blue the blue ball pulsating. <laughs> okay. Um here you can see like uh the LD as well as the standard tin foil packing as well as the cover. So I would say that it doesn't really keep it fresh since it's just a normal packing. There's like no proper seal. Okay, taking one out. Here you have the cigarette. You can see there's the purple ball pulsating as well as like a blue LD print and silver ring. Also you can see below the ring there's like their classic signature, also in silver print. So my theory for the, the purple ball pulsating is that like when you press it right, it just uh, disperses to the filter and everything. So it's like a, a water a water droplet like dripping into the ocean kind of thing, like a ripple effect. It's pretty cool and like um I would say it's a very appealing visual effect. And yeah, like <laughs> the moment you see the ball you just want to press it. Okay, um also the the filter is pretty sturdy and the cigarette length is like a normal is a classic cigarette length. Alright, let's light it up. Okay, so from the first few puffs, oh wait, sorry, it's not lit properly. From the first few puffs, I can say that um, it's not too cold, as well as like there's this uh, very slight bitter aftertaste, and you can also like taste the 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 grape flavor to it, but it's not too strong also. So. For like the coldness rating, I'll give it a 6 out of 10. As well as for the, the grape flavor, I would say it's uh, 7 out of 10. Yeah, it's not too strong. Also, there's like um, not too much chemical aftertaste. <clears throat> and... Uh, it doesn't really burn faster. So yeah, if you're looking for like um, a cheap cigarette to chill with your friends and like drink and smoke and everything, I would say that this is a very uh, good budget cigarette for you. I mean, let's say if you're like broke and everything and like you're feeling the purple, you're feeling menthol and purple together, why not go for this? Uh, you can get this at the local shell kiosk for about eleven fifty to 12 <clears throat> So I'll say it's one of the cheaper cigarettes here. So yeah, overall I'll give this a 7 out of 10 and yeah, that concludes my video. So guys, um, oh wait, sorry, before that, I like to see about, talk about the smoke density also. It is not too thick, so it means it's just nice, like, I will give it like a medium rating. And that concludes my video. So. Don't forget to leave a like and comment and let us know what you want to see in the future videos. Maybe a Q&A or whatever, um, just do let us know as well as to subscribe for future videos. So alright, I'll see you guys in the next video. Smoke on!